Hi, Sarah and Leo. A couple weeks ago on iPad Today, Sarah, you mentioned that you were having trouble with Apple Maps not talking through your Bluetooth stereo, even though you could get audio files to play through your Bluetooth stereo. I think I figured out what was wrong. You were able to get it to work on Google Maps, but not on Apple Maps. Let's take a look. So on my phone here, I've got Google Maps, and you can see I've got my Bluetooth audio ready to go on my, uh, on my stereo. So I'm going to hit start, and we're going to navigate to the Twit Brick House, which seems like a wonderful place to go. Head southeast on North Francisco Avenue toward California 1 North. So you'll notice the sound came out lovely out of my hands-free link, which is the name of my Bluetooth audio. I'm going to kill Google Maps for a moment. Let's go over to Apple Maps and see what happens. We should be able to reproduce the problem you had. So I've got a route to the Twit Brick House, and then I'll hit start, and hit start, and you'll notice that she's not saying anything at all. Down here, normally your screen is going to look like this, but you'll notice right at the very beginning, did you see there was that little button there? It turns out this defaulted, for me anyway, to the iPhone and no voice. If I change it to hands-free link, maybe yours is on your Bluetooth, but it might still say no voice. You can control the volume, which is nice, so that when it interrupts your music, it's not super loud. So we'll set it to normal volume, and it's on hands-free link now. East on Barrel Street. Then turn left onto North Pacific Coast Highway. Ta-da! You now have sound coming out of your Bluetooth stereo in your car from Apple Maps. Hope this helps you out, Sarah.